despite what's happening, we're on the way home. We got to stop at the grocery. It is afternoon. Randy, what up? Sam, hello. Go by Lulu, see if they have any of the Russian beef. I doubt it, but maybe. Michael, what's up, sir? Maybe they will have it, but I don't know. Hey, uh, 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 I'm kind of tired. I don't know why. I shouldn't be tired. Debbie Mac, hello. don't see any other chat. It's there. I see it. I also see where Hinsdale Girl just subscribed. I see all the chat. Everybody's here and happy. Everybody's so happy and overwhelmed. It's another hallelujah. Joyous joy. Be right back. I hear you. Sharon's here. We loop. All right. We're headed to the Lulu. The Lulu Grocery Store. The other day I went and got those steaks and I was not in really, uh, they were cheap, but they were not good. They were not awesome, if you know what I mean. You're happy and horny. If you're happy and you're horny, clap your hands, blap, blap. All right. What's going on here? We've had a cloudy, dismal looking day today. Yeah, the Russian steak sounds like uh, he had a problem. Who had a problem? Some things are not problems. All right, watch out now. That band load of JHR, I guess housemaids or something. That old boy there is driving a little too fast. I wouldn't want to work with that company. The driver driving them around is crazy. Here comes that rain again. Oh yeah, there's a storm to my left. This is funny. We're having good clouds, good rain. All right, hi ho, hi ho. Left we go. British Spice, oh, hello. We're on another uh, routine grocery run. I can't think of anything I've forgotten to buy. I <laughs> wonder when we get to the grocery. I'm sure there's something I want and I can't remember what it is now that I'm thinking about it. I do recall two days ago saying, don't forget to buy that. And now I forget what it was. <laughs> I have something I'm forgetting and I can't remember what I forgot. How does that happen? Don't forget, and now I forgot. Uh, I done forgot what I wanted to take and get, you know? I know there's something here I need. I just don't remember what it was. Hopefully we can figure it out while we're inside. Uh...
you have to write it down. Yeah, I never write it down. Saves money, that way I don't buy a bunch of stuff. <laughs> I'm really bad about not writing down my requirements. Oh boy. Was one other thing I wanted, I just can't remember what it was. It's my person and your person and our person about you. Okay. Pushing the hell out of TVs here. Got a lot of TVs. Look at this cart running sideways, a wheel wiggling. I'm surprised nobody has a cart maintenance company to come in and maintain old carts. All the grocery stores need them carts maintained. Some of that salmon is necessary. No Russian ribeyes. Buy biscuits, crisps, and chocolate cheese. <laughs> they don't have them Russian steaks anymore. They're all sold out everywhere. I wonder why they're so good. All right. Well.
I got some salmon. I got some of the salmon, but the the good steaks are gone. Well, that's life. Huh. All right, well, we won't be having those. They're not available. Miss Josie, hello. Yeah, the salmon is always the best, Barry. Yeah, that's about all I buy here. I don't think of anything else I really buy. Okay. Hola, Prince. What do you say, Mr. Anas? Got eggs, got butter, I have meat and salmon. Another day in KSA, yes sir. Let's find a place. Are you open, ma'am? Which one here? Welcome to work. How are you? Good? Yanny? <laughs> yeah.
can't breathe. <laughs> oh. Hold on. I guess the Russian steaks are out of stock everywhere. I've been to two or three groceries now. They're gone. Maybe it's one big shipment and it all sold out. That's a shame. That was good stuff. We got a bunch of Wagyu beef patties, some salmon, and two cottage Why? cheese. Or three, excuse me, some little cottage cheese. Uh, they finished it in Ramadan. Yeah, they sold out. All gone. Well. Oh. Hit by a... <laughs> I don't know. Kind of sucks. I really like that Russian bee. Damn it. Oh. Hopefully it'll come back soon. I hate it when you get a product you really like and then they stop. You can't get it no more. Uh, can't even get it anymore. What's that tell you? That tells you that was a good product. Everybody enjoyed it. There was no marketing and no advertising. They put it out and I noticed it was selling quickly. I think it's just good quality, good taste. Everybody figured it out quickly. cook them Wagyu beef. They're nice burgers, but they're kind of a mess to cook. Frying them old burgers makes grease all over. I need some stuff at the pharmacy, but I'll do that later. We'll go back out after a while. I ain't gonna stop at the pharmacy. That's what I needed to buy. Them blood checker th strips for the sugar. But I'll do that later. I was playing with that uh, Legion Go today at work during lunch. Man, there's something wrong. I don't understand what's wrong. The buttons are moving around. Something's going on. Something's wrong. I can't figure out what's wrong with it. I click on something, then I go to adjust it, and the thing disappears, and I gotta go try again. Something's wrong. Something ain't right. I can't figure out what it is. Something is causing a conflict. I was going to format and start over, but I got, I'd have to download 100 gigabyte of data. That'll take a week, days. I just cannot figure out which software is causing the problem. It's kind of annoying when you have a software glitch and you can't figure out which software is doing it. most annoying thing. I don't even know what it's called. If your user interface is having a problem on a, 
many apps. It's not the apps. Something in the UI on the Windows. Something's wrong. Ah, it looks like we're going to have to write e support. I have to write and email the support of this Legion company. But first I'll have to film what's going on so they can understand instead of me typing it all out. You know, if you put your mouse over a button and you click it, and then you make a selection on it, well, my button goes all over the place. Disappears, comes up, pops up, pops down. I don't know what the hell's going on. It's kind of weird. Freaking strange. Touch screen is better. It has a touch screen. Even when you use your finger or the mouse, there's something weird about it. Did you have a Bluetooth mouse attached ever? I did. I did have one attached. Maybe I'm going to disconnect the Microsoft Bluetooth mouse and see if that makes that problem go away. Pretty annoying, though. Can't figure out what's causing that problem. Mouse driver. It could be the mouse driver. Something's really wrong. It was driving me crazy today. I just got pissed and gave up. It's like everything I touch is doing a uh, might still be connected. I don't know. It's like the mouse is doing a double click when I press it or unpressing. I don't really know what's going on. It's happening in the mouse and even when I use the touch screen. There's something wrong. If I can't figure it out tonight, I'm going to take it back to where I got it and tell them about the problems. I don't know what they'll do to fix it. I already know what they'll do. They'll just reformat the whole thing. I can do that. It's acting like there's like another mouse somewhere connected that's not there. But there's not one connected. It's really driving me insane. Maybe I can figure it out. Who knows? Usually when I have a very oddball software drive problem, I've installed two apps or two softwares that are totally incompatible and they're arguing with each other. And I don't know which ones it is, so I end up having to format and start all over again. But that's what it feels like. It feels like there's something is arguing with something else. It's like the touch screen is not listening to anything. It's like everything is being ignored maybe delete the driver at the Bluetooth. That's what I'll do. I'll try that first. During my lunch, I was going to sit there and play a game or so and see what's up. 45 minutes into my one hour lunch, and my screen was still dancing all over the place, so I ended up doing nothing. Damn buttons were dancing everywhere. Ah, never seen such a problem very unstable. The Bluetooth device is connected successfully. I don't know what's going on. Hello, is there? Yeah, we're going to get on today. We're going to do some good, uh, we're going to do some, uh, today we will do, uh, Daisy. My truck is all loaded up in Daisy and I'm ready to move my locations. You know, my current house location in Daisy is in a bad area. Every time I go home, I get attacked by zombies. So I got to move my house somewhere where there's not so many zombies. Every time I go home to get in my tent, maybe your mouse is connected too. I don't know. Damn, those zombies keep attacking me when I go home. So we're going to try to get back home, hop in the truck, move the house, and then go back and get the car and move in. We're still learning the mechanics, so we're not fighting anybody yet. We're just learning. 
after I get this learned, then we'll figure it out. But what I've noticed, there's a lot of things that are they game, for lack of a better terminology, that game has a lot of clunk to it. It's like I think it's kind of clunk, clunk. You know what I mean? It's not like uh, it's a very manual game. <laughs> a lot of things are kind of just I don't know. It's like you have to shut the door twice to make it shut, and that's how a lot of the stuff is that game is. You have to double do everything to make it actually work. And when you're fighting a zombie or fight, when you're fighting another creature, that few seconds of delay is to get you killed. Take like months to learn the game. Yeah, it does take a while. Okay. Yes, Earl. Set this helm. I think for dinner, before we get started, we shall have one thing of salmon and some cottage cheese. That sounds like a decent dinner. Big chill in the house, chilling big time. Uh. All right, put these groceries up. We're gonna keep out what we're eating. Everything else can go in the freezer. We're proactive again. Woohoo! We're back to life. Back to life. Back to reality. All right, for dinner, we're going to have one can of Longley Farm Yorkshire cheese. Oh, hell. I bought the wrong one. Let me check my can. Oh, man. I don't eat fat-free cottage cheese. <sighs> I didn't read the label, damn it. 
fat-free. You know how bad fat-free stuff is? I wasn't paying attention. Damn it. I hate fat-free. Fat-free cottage cheese is suck. That's a major mistake. Let's see what it tastes like. I already know it ain't going to be good. Fat free stuff is terrible. I know, I didn't read the label. I ain't gonna eat it. I don't like it. I'm gonna throw it away. I'm not eating it. Tastes too bad. I ain't gonna eat it. Tastes bad. Let's go for some salmon. Yeah, I'm gonna throw it out. I ain't gonna eat it. I don't like that fat free crap. It's very bad. It tastes terrible. It tastes like salt. I don't eat fat free It's I don't know how you get cheese without fat. I can't eat it. It's a throwaway. I just waste ten dollars. Three cottage cheese, that's wasted ten dollars. That one, yeah, the smoked salmon's great. You can't make it better. It's nasty. It's like the time I accidentally bought bacon cheese. I threw it away. Starving kids in Africa don't need food. They need a U-Haul. If you live in a country that has no food and water, you need to move. Quit staying in a country that don't have no food and water. No, it's ten, three dollars per container. I bought three of them. I don't know how I didn't see the label. Three bucks is overpriced, I guess. I shop too fast. I just want to get in there and get out. No! Here. 
they like that salmon skin. I just went by the whole logo. I didn't make a sign. I made a mistake. Free cottage cheese tastes just like salt. It's like eating salted cheese. It's it's terrible. Give it to the stray cats. That's probably a good idea. I can't eat it. Wasted my money. We'll continue in a little bit. Today we have a truck and we're moving. We have our truck is loaded and we're moving somewhere. So today's adventure is moving. It's moving day on Daisy. ready for a good laugh. Let's see how it works. Let's get it all booted up here. Ow! I'm having a bit of my sciatic nerve pain today. It started happening about an hour ago. Damn little hip is hurting again. We'll have to deal with that. to exercise this is more you can't exercise if you're in pain you can't do anything you don't understand it's painful you can't even move it hurts so bad sometimes you just gotta freeze in place uh, exercise don't help because you can't do it yeah you can't move in you can't even move you're frozen in pain you got to stop and hold up something for a little bit. I do have a new anti-inflammatory that helps it not... It, oh, I should take that now. I'm glad you sell it. I have a new anti-inflammatory that works. I need to take that right now. I'll show it to you. This thing actually worked. Oh. We have a new one that works. This here is a Mobin Meloxicam. It's pretty fast acting too. And it is, it's in these type of a pill. Do you make me on you out twitch? Very little. <laughs> Very little. We used to a year ago, but they changed all the rules. We lost half, and yeah, it's not that good. Used to be okay, no more. Every time they change something, they make sure you don't make no money. Yeah, I need to see a doctor. There's no doubt I will someday. I 
to show you the money on Twitch so you can see and then I'll explain. I'm not shy to show you. That way you do not get any false ideas thinking you're going to get rich on Twitch. Okay, here you go. Check it out. In the month of April, from April 1st to the April 15th, I broadcast 143 hours, and they're going to give you $303. My internet connection and other things that I use cost me $188. So after the 303 minus the 188, I am left with $120. Seven dollars of that hundred and twenty seven dollars you're supposed to pay your anything else you use electric or something so no the money's not good at all I end up at the end of the month with a hundred twenty dollars extra <laughs> it ends up being like 32 cents per hour time you have your computer you have your everything all doctors say is exercise with it, will they? What about... What about bitching people that fall, fail? Are you beggars at work? If you beg a lot, you can make good money, but I don't beg. Yeah, plus income tax. Well, I lose money on this business. There is no tax. I, I'm at a loss, 100% loss. I'm at 100% lost every month. So it's a loss. I lose money every month. Getting no exercise and even stretch and or even stretching makes yeah, I walk every day during the office hours. Every hour I take a 10 minute walk every day. Today I didn't walk as much as I usually do. That's why I'm probably having the pain. But at the office, every one hour, I get up and walk around 15 minutes. Today, I was a little lazy in my walking efforts. Yeah, today, I did not walk enough. I was concerned about some things. All right, where am I here? Yeah, it doesn't lose money, but it doesn't make money. All right, here we go. Uh, bits. Bits help take care of That's all the money, bits and everything included. You didn't see the whole breakdown? I'll show it to you again. Apparently, you're not getting it. You're missing. Apparently, you don't understand. Apparently, you're, you're vague on the whole concept. You're not getting the, how it works. Okay, yeah, let's show you here. Of that $303, on this day, I got $1.41 in subs, $7 for ads, no bits. On this day, no bits. I got $10 for ads, though. On this day, I got no bits. On this day, no bits. On this day, where's the bit money? $13, that was a good day. For some reason, everybody was happy on, what day was that? April 6th, I did get, I got, Third, I got money for bits. People think you get rich stream. You don't make jack shit. If you pay for the stuff that you do and what you use, yeah, people say, I'm going to be a streamer and be, you ain't going to make no money. I've been doing this 10 years. 
every year for the past two years, Twitch is taking your money. They're taking, they don't, they take 45, but they're taking more and more every, I used to get $25 a day for ads, now I'm three to five dollars. They keep taking more and more and more. Yeah. They keep taking more and more and more. That's why you have a real job. I, mean, I get a real job because this don't pay nothing. If you stream from China, you get paid in U.S. dollars. I don't know how it works. I don't. You get. I don't know how it all works. Maybe to lose some clothes. I ain't worried about it. If I was worried about it, I'd stop. You think that's funny? Let's show you something else. I'm gonna show you something even more funny. You're going to like this. <laughs> Check this out. In the past 28, my videos on YouTube uh, had 17,500 views, 2,500 watch time hours, and they're going to give me $25. That's for 28 days of YouTube. $25 I get from a YouTube after 28 days. And they won't give it to you until it gets to $300. So it'll be six months before they send you anything. Only beggars and subs and things make, I mean, you got to beg or you got you to do a lot of stuff. Again, I don't do that. I had 1.4 million views and you get like $37. <laughs> uh, answer will be hot tub streams. No, it ain't. Only even some of those don't make money. Some do, some don't. Okay, where are we at now? I just got the camera up. I'm just trying to explain to you. It's not this uh, fantastic power hour that people think. Ain't nobody getting rich. <laughs> Yeah, ain't nobody getting rich. Need to try TikTok. The TikTok is the lowest paying app in the world. People get a penny. It, it's not about, I have a real job. I have a real job. I bet if you walked around in your speedo, cash would roll in. Mr. Waleed, whoop, whoop, thank you, sir. Yeah, I have a real job, so that's why I do it. Thank you for the bit, sir. Okay, we're going to go for the... I think there's a way to get rich there. It has to be. Yeah, there is, but I'm not... I don't broadcast every hour with a show weekly and do edited videos. If I, had a, if I did it for a living, I would be doing it differently. I would have hour a show certain days, certain times... I would actually do it way differently. Now I'm just a random IRL. It may be daily, but it's still random. If I wake up late, it's late. You know, I don't do it like consistent times. Thank you, David, for the bits. Thank you, everyone. So it's just how I do it. But I choose to do that. It's not like I'm... Uh, thank you again for the bits. Thank you again. It's not like that I'm... Uh, If I treat it like a business, it will become a business, but I don't. Yeah, people complain about the ads. I need a million dollars worth of ads just to make two dollars. You don't understand. I, that's why when people claim about this and that, I just like to show them the truth. That way they don't have no false things. Just show people. It's not. I don't care. It's better just to show people. Whoop, whoop on the bits. Thank you again. Yeah, it's better just to show people what's going on. It's easier that way. That way you don't have a bunch of nonsense. Yeah, I'm not depending on it as an income. 
I only uh, do it, but I need it just to pay for itself. That's but you know, if it's not paying for itself, then it sucks. Okay, we have another problem here now. I don't understand this. I'm having a file conflict. Whoop whoop on the bids. I'm having a file conflict. I don't know why. I'm definitely going to have to reset the whole Legion Go. Every time I boot up now, I'm having a new conflict. Check this out. I'm having a new cloud status file conflict. There's something wrong in my account somewhere. I don't understand what's going on. I never had these problems before. Something is screwing me up. That damn Legion go, and then I'm having random errors all over. Thank you for the subs. Gift whoop whoop. Thank you for gifting the subs. So I'm having a random problem here. I wonder what it is. File conflict. Well, Verify the game files through Steam. I'm on Steam right now trying to verify it. I don't know what's going on. This is Steam. It's kind of strange. Thank you for gifted sub. Appreciate it a lot. Thank you very much. Okay. I'm now. Anyway, isn't that the weirdest thing? These errors are random all of a sudden. It's been going on for a couple of days. I can't figure out why I'm having this problems. I just can't figure it out. It may be my data connection is so bad. What do you think? Or is the Legion Go causing me a conflict? I just can't figure it out. I think you download too much random junk. I don't though. If you look at my laptop, I have nothing on my laptop. I don't have any software. Really, I don't have anything. I don't, there's nothing I have. No telling. All right, look at your mouse drivers. Yeah, that's on the other item. I think the Legion is not good for playing DayZ. Could be wrong. I believe that you're totally correct about that. You can play PUBG on it, but DayZ you cannot without connecting the keyboard. It, it may be this uh, Legion causing the problem. Maybe it's a big brother. They can do whatever they want. All this random weirdo stuff. Okay, we have a major problem. <laughs> Until we fix this, we will not be playing DayZ. Oh, God. Let me go reset all the network. Check this out. I was about to play DayZ. Look at the ping. 1,073 millisecond ping. Well, you can't play no DayZ with that kind of a problem. That is unfreaking believable. All right, we got to go reset the network. This ain't going to work at all. Hold on, we got to reset everything. Oh my, Wayne Nut, what's up, Steve? Let's go reset this network. We have a major problem. Can't do anything with that. Ah. Uh,
All right. We've reset the router. We'll try again. Tina, what's up? How are you? It'll take a minute for the router to reset. 1980 style. I crack up when I see that. Yeah, that's it's an old style. Nothing you can do. It is what it is. You're good, Tina. I'm glad to hear it. I'll be good in a few minutes when things start working. Jane, what are you doing? Daisy launcher is corrupt. Is that what it is? Maybe. I actually think it's the Legion Go causing me problems. Need a 5 gigahertz wireless iron router maybe. Need some upgrade, but I bought everything last year. You don't remember last year I was, I tried everything and bought everything. I was paying almost $400 a month to keep all the connections and it has no improvement. I had to stick to a 5G router in the window on a pole so I could get a connection. It was very bad. I tried that for months. That didn't work out. We've already tried every available technology here and it's not nothing I can do about it. It is what it is, and I can't do anything. We've tried. It's not like I didn't put the effort in and go for it. Believe me, I tried. All right. <laughs> it was so funny. Maybe sick in the 1980s in the window. It was unbelievable. I think when you try playing DZ on the Legion, the other day, something got screwed up. It did. It screwed something up. You know what? We're going to go ahead. Before we get started, let's go ahead and format the Legion. And we'll just have to start over from scratch. There's something wrong on that Legion. We're going to have to format it and start all over. There's something I can't figure out. I'll have to troubleshoot it for weeks. Let's go ahead and format it while I'm here. Let's take it in the other room, just let it format itself, and then we'll come back to this. We'll start Daisy in a minute. This whole legion thing has been causing me so much problem. Maybe we can shake, get rid of these problems. doing this. You know how long it's going to take to put it back. Oh, God.
Myrna, what's up, Miss Myrna? Is there a option to reset the whole thing, or do you have to do it like a regular computer? You know what? We'll do it later. Let's let it charge. We'll let it charge now. We'll do it later. That will take too much nonsense to play with. All right. Alright, uh, if for those on YouTube and Twitch, we will be doing this daisy on both. So I'm going to cut this down. I'll be back and just refresh. Get ready to refresh. We'll be right back. If you refresh, you're welcome. If you don't, well, on you. Now, just refresh. We'll be back in a minute. 